is up everyone? I am here at Disneyland as you guys can see behind me and I'm here for a bunch of different reasons. I kind of just wanted a day at the park because the next week is going to be kind of crazy in my life but I wanted to do a video that some people do but I wanted to give my own twist on it. I wanted to do a what's in my Disney bag video. So I usually have two types of bags that I bring to the park. Either a bag for when I'm doing all of my photo stuff. So that's usually on a bigger day, more like a dapper day or an event style day and I'll have a lot more camera gear with me or I'll have more of a casual bag like I do today. So I thought I'd break down what I have in my casual Disney bag. So first thing is the bag itself. This is actually my Christmas gift from Allie. Um, it's based on one of those two 2D bag and it's just a nice little side uh, crossbody bag, really expandable strap. It actually expands so I can make it really thin or I can keep it wide like this. And the first thing that's usually in there is my phone. So I'll just have my regular iPhone 7 Plus and I have a pop sack on the back that I custom painted. Um, that way I can hold it better and I can actually lean it down so if I want to transfer photos from my camera I can do it right to my phone and just look at them this way and edit them. Then I will actually have my camera which I am shooting with the G7X right now on a mini little gorilla style pod and that can fit right into here. Sometimes I will bring the grill pod, sometimes I won't. It just kind of depends on the day. Today I wanted to do it because I knew I was gonna be filming this video and also because I was taking a bunch of selfies and product photos of this sweatshirt. This sweatshirt, if you guys don't know, is actually from my clothing line, Designer Dust, which there will be a link to in the description bar below. By the time this video goes live, this sweatshirt will actually be up on my site in three different colors. The next thing that is going to be in my bag is usually a set of ears, whether they are custom made or if there are ones that I buy at the parks or they're ones that I make myself, I usually have a set of ears with me at all times when I'm at the parks. Then I will have my wallet, which I just keep a smaller wallet usually when I go to Disney parks. Um, it has usually my ID, my credit cards, my cash, everything in here. And that's just, it's a smaller wallet to have instead of having my bigger, bulkier wallet. Next will usually be my glasses or my sunglasses that I just have in this little rose gold pouch. So I just have some cheap little sunglasses in here and then these glasses, which I love. Next Next will usually be my makeup bag. Uh, this is actually a little bag from Ipsy, and in there right now I have my lip color, which is Gemini from Jeffree Star. I usually have my mascara, because I kind of like to always stick it up my mascara. Um, I'll have a lip plumper, because I'm a highlight whore. I'll have my highlighter that I have on. Right now I'm gonna have on Becca's Champagne Pop. And I will have some pressed powder, and a brush. And then also in here I'll usually have an eyeliner. A pair of nail scissors because you never know when you're gonna get a hangnail and sometimes you need to like trip a thread off of someone's crap or if you buy something you can snip the tag off easier. I have an extra hair elastic um, and I have feminine products in case any of my friends ever need them because I feel like that's a good thing to have, especially to park because you never know. I, I know when I get my thing but it's sometimes good to always have that in your bag. Next it will be probably one of the most fun things that I have in my bag, which is a selfie light. Now, this one actually clips right to the top of my phone, so I can go like that, or I can flip it around if I'm doing selfies. Uh, if I have my big DSLR, I usually have actually a block LED that I use with me. This has three modes, and you just press it one, two, three, and it gets brighter. And this thing is amazing, and I can even throw it on the screen of my G7X if I'm filming at night, which I really like. Depending on the day, sometimes I'll bring this, sometimes I won't. This is actually a five-in-one pocket reflector. So this is great if you're with friends and you want to take a bunch of really fun portraits. It actually folds up really small, and it's silver on one side, black on the other. You open it up, and it's white, so you have a sunscreen, and then it's gold and white on the other side. So that is really great for taking photos and for doing smaller videos. The next thing will be an external battery and cords and earbuds. I am a junkie for listening to music when I'm walking around the park sometimes. Sometimes I'll listen to podcasts that way I'm making myself walk a little bit more or if I have to take a phone call it's a little bit easier to hear with. And then I just have a uh, lightning cord for my phone. I do want to get one that's inside of a keychain so it's a little bit easier. And then I actually have a external battery. This one is from Justin. I got it at Kohl's and it actually charges my phone about three times and it's awesome. Um, and it actually tells you the, per the percentage you have left. This means it has 100% when it says 99 because it doesn't go up to 100. 
In addition to having extra batteries for my phone, I will always carry an extra battery for my camera. This is usually either in my makeup bag or it's in the front of my bag. And I also have a extra memory card inside of my wallet. Sometimes I'll carry pins with me, so I just have a couple of some other sneak peeks of Designer's Dust merch, as well as some tradable uh, Disney pins in case I see a cute one on a cast member. And then lastly, in this back little pocket, which I love, I will have keys, a wall outlet, just in case. Especially if I'm with friends and we all don't want to go out to dinner, maybe. This is actually something I carry with my bag at all times. This is a PayPal swipe, so that I can swipe everyone's cards onto my PayPal cards. We can all pay on one card. And because my phone doesn't have a headphone jack anymore, I actually have the dongle, so it automatically attaches to an iPhone 7 or higher. So yeah. So that is everything that is in my Disney bag. If you guys have any questions about what I carry when it's for a bigger event, or any questions about the bag, or any of the items that I talked about, let me know in the comment section below or you guys can tweet at me at Nick Wise on Twitter and I can respond to that as well. Hey! <laughs> who's there? Who's on that? camera? Oh my god. We're on camera? Hey! <laughs> camera? You're Phil? This is why I love Disney This is how you do it. We are working here all night long. Oh yeah. There's also that little notification bell, so if you guys want to be updated every time I upload a video, hit that little bell and you'll get an email or a notification of some type. So thank you guys for watching and don't forget to live each day a little more wise. Bye guys!